today is a stereotypical late June day. It is pretty wet and humid. It's out in like 65, 70 degrees right now, but we just hit 400 video uploads, so I figured I'd do that video today. Now here's the thing about this video. I'm probably just gonna be playing around with the clips for viewer attention and stuff, but I'm gonna just like give like a brief little garden update before I move on to the chickens and other stuff. Yeah, this is very similar to my three, no, 200 video special. Except I scrapped that one. I still even have the original thumbnail of that video on my computer. It's just the video files were corrupted. And I'll get into that like later in this video. So if you really are curious to know what happened, uh, there's a timestamp on screen. All right, so here are the peppers, as you clearly see. Uh, they are still green, but they will get their colors as time progresses. They will slowly but surely gain colors. And well, no matter how much of a jalapeno pepper they look like right now. They will become like yellow, orange, red, you know. I can't wait to have this on my pizza. I bet by like, I don't know, like the end of the summer or early fall, I'm gonna have like, I don't know, a Domino's pizza from my kitchen instead of actually having to go out of my way to order a pizza. Well, I don't do the ordering. I just sit on my hand and respond to comments all day. Right now, here are the chickens. This actually has some updates to do with it for the 400 video special here. And so, first things first, that little tree back there came down last night during the storm. Oh, we didn't get that much room. We got like half an inch, maybe. It's not that much, but it is soaking wet out right now. And well, yeah, ducks are doing pretty good. I have a lot of videos coming out. I have a new whiteboard. A lot of them are going to be about chickens. Falcon is becoming pretty much just a really bad rooster. Yeah, that's what happens when you have any type of rooster for like, I don't know, the first year or so. Like, the rooster could take a turn to the devil's side. Either way, like, it could be an old rooster, like, I don't know, seven, eight years old. He could just randomly turn to the devil. So that's the thing about roosters. They basically scale their attacks on, like, past things. And well, Falcon has basically become sort of like a devilish rooster. And he is actually starting to, like, pummel me, but here's the thing. He can't, like, land a spur attack, so I basically feel absolutely nothing. So I just nudge him off my legs when that ever happens. It's not that hard. Well, yeah. The chickens are basically like, they're doing good. Ed came down back there. This video is sort of just an update on life. I don't really care either way. And yeah, I'm gonna take it down to the farm block on the 1st of July, which happens to be a nightmare day for some reason. That, that actually happens to be a thing for me. Um, here we go. We're gonna show you the farm flock, and on the 1st of July, I'm gonna drop a video about the farm flock. Because, well, farm flock on the 1st of July, we almost had our first chicken loss, but they came, the chicken came back after like a day. Maybe like a day and a half. And I dropped that video on that almost a year ago now, and damn, my voice sounded so different back then. And I remember filming it, and, and I thought my voice sounded something like it does now, but it, it really doesn't. Here's the farm flock. Their yard is a muddy mess right now. Well, we're definitely gonna have to move them soon. Um, I think I just discovered a nest back here. All right, I'm gonna have to look for that. Yep, there is a chicken brooding in the bush. And fun fact, this video is not scripted. So basically, that means that if I find a chicken brooding in here again, like, during the scripting, I just act like nothing happened. But, like, still. There's literally a chicken brooding somewhere back here. Well, not really, like, brooding or anything, but, like, still. I know for a fact there's a chicken back here, because I literally just heard it. I'm not sure where, but I am pretty sure I just heard a rooster. I mean, a chicken. I would think it's a buff, just based on just going off of the sounds. Just going off of the sounds, I can tell it's probably a buff, but I honestly don't know. Ah, freaking bugs. Yeah, Waldo's sort of becoming a bad rooster again, but it's still nothing like he was over the summer. And yeah, there's something brooding in there. I don't know what chicken it is, it's most likely a buff, but you never know. Yeah, the, the farm flock has been doing pretty good. Well, yeah, my best bet is that they're probably gonna have a good summer this year. Unless the fox comes back for another attack. It looks like we're gonna have a pretty damn good summer this year. Right, Marin? 
Now before I tell you about this channel, I just want to give like one more little brief update here. So we're down the, so right now we're investigating to see where that chicken is, just in case you know. Well yeah, other than the rain, we are currently in a pretty sizable drought right now. It's not bad yet, we're in an orange, a really light orange, so not yet like a sizable drought, but definitely a notable one, so y'all are going to have to be very careful about water if you're in a drought right now. This is actually kind of important because like, if there's a drought going on, you know, there can actually be some pretty serious consequences that can happen. Like if you use too much water in your garden or your chickens and you just like don't ration it out, like you can slightly ration it out. Don't completely ration it out because of dehydration, but you can slightly ration it out. So if that ever does come your way, just remember that droughts, they were never meant for humans, okay? Droughts are absolutely terrible things. And about, I don't know, two years ago, we were in a pretty devastating one. Like, we were in like, not the dark, yeah, not the dark red. I mean, the exceptional, we were in the extremes, like the light red. It was pretty bad, and then it got better for, then it got better throughout the course of the fall. And then we had another drought last, last spring. We were in like, we were actually in a, in a severe drought last spring. So, actually a darker orange than what we're currently in right now. I seriously, I think that our drought right now, it's probably only gonna take a few storms to wipe it out, so. I'm thinking we're probably gonna have another summer like last year, but if it's any worse, just remember this YouTube channel is here to document every single bad storm that comes around the, our way this summer. Now I really had no good ideas for this upload today. So I'm gonna do a, a special similar the 200 video special. No, I'm not talking about my game 200 video special. I'm actually talking about like my previous idea, which was a major update. It was about 30 minutes long, but this video is a lot less than that. Because, well, storage space, okay? But, like, still. The videos that you're going to be seeing in the future, here, I'm just going to give an update on this, are all going to be in 720p. Now, there is actually a reason behind that. I have to make these videos really quickly. They'll still be well edited, don't you worry. In fact, I'm probably going to be able to keep this well edited streak videos up, if I don't know, probably like the next uh, few weeks. But here's the thing. I don't really have a lot of time to just like wait for a 1080p 60 export. So instead of that, I'm really just going to like go and sort of just like, I don't know, like make the video look good, but then export it in either 1080p without 60 FPS or 720p 60. You know, there's a good reason behind that, you know, I just don't have a lot of time to wait for an export. Thumbnail quality won't drop, instead, might even rise a little bit. My videos are doing pretty good right now. The latest video broke 100 views, it's pretty amazing, to say the least. Now back to what I was talking about before, for my 200 video special, the original update was 30 minutes long. I didn't scrap it because it was 30 minutes long, but the moment I got it on there, and I actually edited it pretty well, in fact, I spent over seven days working on that video, and here's the thing about that video, oh my god, here's the thing about that video, you know, you see, so when you edit a video super well, occasionally, well, you know, some things might happen to the video file. And the video got corrupted, and I lost all of the video file. So instead of that, I just back, instead of just backing up the data, and just re-putting, instead of putting the stuff back on the computer like I should have, and then just like re-edited the whole thing, I didn't really want to waste eight di another eight nine days of my life. So instead of doing that, I really just like, like just completely, like, and by completely, I mean like completely. Just like, scrapped that video idea altogether. I actually still have the camera footage. But I just don't feel like taking another eight days of my life to edit a big video like that. Unless, of course, it's a humongous project, which it really was just for fun, honestly. That's about it for this video. If you did enjoy, be sure to drop a like and subscribe to this channel. And also drop a comment too if you want to suggest any video ideas or anything else. I will be uploading every single day over the course of as long as I can possibly keep it up for. Power just went out.